what is up this is Thunder 9 EJMR and today I'm showing you how to install one of my favorite mods the lots of food mod as you guys can see I am using a Mac but in this episode I will be showing you how to install them on three different types of computers Mac Lion, Mac Snow Leopard and Windows computers the first computer that I'm going to show you how to install I and mean, how to install the mod on will be the Mac Lion if you don't have this version or a computer, please click on the annotation on the video screen of what you have. But or you can check out the description. But it's all the same, really. Like screen, not nah, whatever. Oh, before I put up the annotation to the different installations, you have to download these two files: the mod and mod loader. So um, I also put out annotation if you already downloaded it. But um, so yeah, and so let's. But for now, I'm going to show you where I'm going to download it. So, I see there's a, obviously lots of food. So go down. I, I love this mod. I And it's updated to 1.2.5. It's awesome. <laughs> um, oh. So, if you have Windows, click this one. And if you have Mac, click, obviously, this one. And this is a sweet house. They can sometimes get in the blah, blah, blah. Yeah, they sometimes get in the way of building stuff, but I like them because they have like cool stuff and chests and etc. Anyway, so I'm I have a Mac, but you know, so I'm just gonna but I want with houses, so I'm just gonna download with houses. Boom. So that was fast. Then let's go into mod loader, and there we go. Um, just download in AdFly because it's only like. An extra five seconds, like, shush. Uh, sure, sh I'll turn out. I'll cut out this sound. Urge door button. Or exercise out. Uh oh. Was it? No, this was a new. So you drag the sound to your desktop or whatever, and um, yeah. So the annotations will be up in five, four, three, two, one. Boom. All right, so click and let's begin. Okay, you've chosen the Mac Lion. All right, cool. So here's how I do it. First, you access your you yeah you access your Minecraft folder. Now, ever since Apple updated their computers, they've basically hidden the library folder. So here's what we have to do. So on the top of the screen, you see the Go thing. Just go down to uh, Go to Folder and type in uh, Squiggly Lion. Um, it's above the tab key, have press shift, and above the button above the tab key. It's not that hard to find. Slash, and then library. Press go, and you can either drag out this icon. Bleh. Well, we can't really do it in um, thing with Drake. Sorry, in. Ah, blinking. I'm blink. Bleh. <laughs> Can't really do it in um, Snow Leopard, but in line you can. Anyway, um, so you go in application support, then Minecraft. I suggest drag out your Minecraft folder onto the thing, which is much easier to get to. But yeah, so that's how you go into your Minecraft thing. So you can just delete this, or what you can earn uh, sex out, or you can just go into your Minecraft and click the button called. Uh, so you got options, then click force update, then done, then login. Sometimes if you already have a mod installed, force update does not work. Um, so it's just easier to delete the bin, I find. Anyway, so now you got yourself a fresh Minecraft folder bin. So just, well, yeah, bin. Anyway, so I already showed how to get into your Minecraft folder, so I'm not showing you again. Blah. Uh, so you go into your bin. And there's two things you can do to open this. You can either download an app from the app I, from the app store called the Unarchiver, but that requires something called an Apple ID and that sort of yeah. So either use the Unarchiver to well unarchive it. Because if you you might have noticed that um that yeah, sorry, archive utility doesn't work anymore. It just does another file, so just do minecraft.jar, change it to minecraft.zip, and 
then double click and boom you got yourself another folder and now you can delete this but I prefer just doing Minecraft backup because it's easier to I don't know just easier to um, do this instead of making a whole entire new Minecraft um, dot jar I mean my Minecraft bin so now that you opened it up you go to your mod loader just no uh, you can do command A then command C it exits out of the mod loader then you do command V to paste it in just replace everything just don't do merge or whatever just replace oh herp derp um then what you do is go into your lots of food with houses thing then you copy all I mean just command A to select all the command C then paste it in place then this most important go to meta inf and move that to trash because you don't want no more well anymore so let's see if it works or if it gives you a black screen but I will tell you that it works there we are it works pretty cool all right so thanks for watching and there'll be annotation on the screen to see the end of the video because I have a lot of uh, stuff about like about this mod like you'll just see so you, you know you can just click on it that'd be really cool of you um okay yeah so uh thanks for watching and i'll see you mac line users later bye okay so i see that you have chosen the mac snow leopard or you haven't exited the video from the mac latin part derp Anyway, so this is quite easy. So go to your home folder, library, or home folder, library, application support, and Minecraft. So there you can delete the bin folder. There we go. Because we want a fresh one. We want a fresh one. Or you can, or what you can do is options force update. Okay. Because sometimes force update doesn't work, so I just prefer deleting the bin for like a hundred percent chance of like getting a new jar. So, okay, starting. All right, fresh bin, yeah. So I showed you where how to find your Minecraft folder, so I'm gonna re-show you. So open up your bin, and isn't it pretty? It's pretty, pretty. <laughs> anyway, um. So what you do is you right click to open with archive utility. Then you got this thing. You can e either call this Minecraft backup yeah, dot jar or just delete it. I prefer to keep it though because it's e it's easier just making another Minecraft folder out of this file than it is um, than making an entire new bin. <laughs> So then you open up Minecraft.jar, and anyway, so it's amazing. So then press Command A. It will open the model. Then press Command A, Command C, copy. Then Command V to paste, and click Apply to All and replace all the files. Okay, so now you got Mod Loader installed. Now open up Lots of Food Houses. Well, yeah, Lots of Food with Houses. Then Command A, Command C, and then Command V to in, inside the minecraft.jar and then most important thing go and type me then find the folder called metainf just delete it because then it stops from working i'll show you that doesn't crash the game all right what did i tell you so yeah um that was you know, easy all right so that's how you do it and if you now i'll put a little annotation up if you want to go to the end of the video because I tell you like a bunch of stuff it is just like it's like some stuff like important though it's important if you want to know how to use mod like it's a link yeah Blah. okay so um hopefully I'll see you guys there at the end of the video bye all right so apparently you have a windows computer or in fact you have a Mac and you didn't close the window. Completely acceptable ish. Okay. So 
um, windowed people. You need WinRAR for this or JZip um, so you can edit your Minecraft stuff. If you've done Mod before, you should have this. Anyway, so, what's your do? So, open up your Minecraft, go to Minecraft, derp derp, press options, then force update, then done. Login. That, or you can, or I'll show you. Oh, as you can see, it failed. So, if this happens, if you have a mod installed, you Windows users. So, there should be this little small thing in your search box. No, sorry, start menu. <laughs> um, and type in percent app data percent. No spaces, nothing. Just percent app data percent. And press enter. And then it should. Then there should be something that looks like on this at the top of it. This. Alright, okay, so what do you do? So you open it up. Or and then you can delete your bin. Then you and then and that's another way to get a fresh bin. So updating Minecraft. Okay, cool. So, just go back. So, percent updated percent, and you're in here. And what you do is go into your bin, and then open with um, something called. Uh, you open with something called uh, WinRAR or JZip, but. Um, but um since I don't um, I don't have that system sees pretend this isn't happening. So you can just delete this. Well Minecraft dot jar. Add the not sure. Yeah. Anyway, so open up your Minecraft dot jar. And alright, so you're into your folder, Minecraft folder. Go into mod loader, press control A and then just copy these files, then paste these files to your minecraft.jar and apply to all as you replace these files. Then in X out of the mod loader window, so open the lots of food with houses. Uh, control A, copy, and paste them into the minecraft.jar. And then most importantly, go to something called go to the M's, find the folder metainth, just do that trash. So I'll show you that it works and that it didn't crash my Minecraft. So there we go. Anyway, so now I'm at the end of the video. So hold on a second. Okay, so you're at the end of the video now. Yay! So here are a couple links. Um because in a couple days well not yet. In a couple days, um I'll be using this mod. Um like how and showing you guys how to use this mod and um there'll be a bit of animation in it so you know you're in for a treat um but yeah if this tutorial helped you out um you know just like comment and yeah and um if you want a more mod installation or review just leave a suggestion yeah, suggestion in the comments or private message me. So yeah, um, also please subscribe, this help you out. It really helps a lot. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys later. Hopefully it worked for you guys, it worked for me. And again, see you guys later. Bye.